what are you supposed to be doing with your life? Have a purpose and do it on purpose. I believe that loving people is one of the most important things in the world, and I do it on purpose. I don't wait to feel like it. I don't wait to want to. I do it on purpose. And I didn't do it for many, many years, but I do now because I've learned that loving people is the only way to be happy. If you want to make yourself happy, get yourself off your mind and focus on loving God and loving people. I said, if you want to be happy, get yourself off your mind and focus on loving God and loving people. Amen. And I see all of you watching TV at home or watching me on the internet, and I'm talking to you too. If you want to be happy, focus on loving God and loving people. And by the way, you want to love yourself too. You shall love your neighbor as you love yourself. If you don't have a good relationship with you, then you're not going to have a good relationship with anybody else because you can't give away something you don't have. If you don't like you, you're not going to like anybody. Know your purpose. And you know we all have more than one purpose, but we need to know the most important purposes. Like the scripture I read you about faith and love. That's something to focus on as a believer. I want to stay in faith. I want to walk in love. If I can get up every day, stay in faith, and walk in love, I can go to bed that night and feel like that I have done what God wanted me to do. Stay in faith and walk in love. Lack of focus is a huge, huge, huge problem. We need to be decisive. You need to make decisions. And whatever it is you feel like you're supposed to be doing, you need to be fully committed to it. I talked last night about being fully committed, not just partially committed, but fully committed. Jesus said, you're either with me or you're not. Be hot, be cold, but don't be lukewarm. I like to say, get in, get out, or get run over. We need to be on fire 